What happens when a RuneScape clan runs itself in the ground? When its ranks propagate lies and misinformation? When its own loyal members have given up on the clan? I was able to uncover the inner workings and secrets of this organization and bring to light its internal struggles within the rank team. This house of cards was destined to fail, so this is a story of how I infiltrated and brought down Beyond Control. The story starts in late September of 2022, when me and Haun 2, the leaders of Fearless, decided to join Reign of Terror. As Fearless was on good terms with Rot, we were both allowed to intro and were accepted. Until, I decided to see if I could help the ranks and infiltrate an anti-Rot clan for intel. Beyond Control was an easy choice, and before long, I found myself contacting Benz and making a false narrative of how much I resented Rot. These are a few of the conversations I had with him. Within a week of gaslighting and fluffing up Benz's ego, I was allowed to join the clan, get TS access, and start attending trips. Me and the Rot ranks were laughing our asses off that Benz allowed me to join, despite the fact that I was ex Reign of Terror, ex Sovereign, and I came from a clan that directly beefed with BC. Not only that, but I was their leader. Everybody from the clan world knew that I was spying. Even the rot ranks thought that I would only last a few weeks. It was only due to Benz's incompetence that I was allowed to be there. Essentially, the only requirement to join BC is to either dislike rot or pretend like you do. And this is why BC was always doomed to fail. A clan with no history, no standards, and one of the worst ranked teams I've ever seen. My first five months in BC went along smoothly. I helped with calling, which Benz was impressed with since BC lacked a good caller that spoke coherent English. I also started making videos and clips for Benz, which also impressed him. I didn't know how, all I really did was copy rot videos. A few months in, BC's other leader, Gambit, had a huge falling out with Benz which Benz instigated by the way, and took a third of the clan with him. Another third of the clan left a few weeks later, when Benz started instigating Zuck for absolutely no reason. This led to all the shared BP members mass leaving, along with Daz, another BC rank. Since then, BC has tried to crash BP, but have absolutely no impact whatsoever. It's kinda embarrassing when a main clan gets rolled over and over again by pure clan. I mean, Rot hits pure clans like Venom in Fatality and gets them to bend the knee in a day. Meanwhile, BC has spent over a year hitting the same clan and are still getting clowned on. The remaining leftover members in BC were either auto-ranked, rev, and seal members that never came to trips, or members who were more active in other clans than they were in BC. Because of all the help I was providing to Benz, he decided to rank me as captain, the second highest rank he can get in BC. Things just got really weird. How the hell do you rank someone who's been associated with Rot for over 8 years? How desperate was Benz? And how did any of the other ranks put up with this decision? These are questions that I'm still asking to this day. With this rank, I was given access to member IPs, admin chats, server logs, and helped make decisions such as what clans we were hitting, who would be allowed to join, and much more. 
I was Benz's second in command, and he had complete faith in me despite others telling him not to. He even had to argue for my sake in front of Scaper, who begged him to kick me for hours on voice. And the embarrassment doesn't end there. In late 2023, Dole, a rank and rot, decided to leave main planning behind and reopen EOP. Benz immediately assumed that Dole scammed rot, which is completely false. He started propagating this lie over and over again, and somewhat became obsessed with Dole. In a desperate attempt, he contacted Dole to offer to pay him to give up rot leaks in BC. Dole accepted the offer and instantly started working with rot ranks to scam this Dutch noob out of his precious dollars. Not only that, but innocent people in BC was kicked because of this. I almost feel bad for him. I mean, Benz has been incapable of paying for anything. He actually had to pull money together from other ranks and legends to be able to afford to kick people who didn't even spy. What a moron. So, whenever you see an anti-rot noob claiming that Dole heisted rot, the truth is, Dole heisted Benz and got his members kicked, all to benefit Rot at the end of the day. Good job Benz, you truly got outplayed again. Benz is just the tip of the iceberg. Look at these other morons I had to deal with during my time in BC. Your trust in voice boys, they're about to end soon. User disconnected from your channel. <coughs> so do you guys want one meal each? Or you want like a drop party at the end of trip? Or what do you guys want? Click so free? Yeah, yeah, it does. He literally died. He literally just died for everything in front of me. Close the door, Mike. On three, yeah? Oh, uh, you're okay. You spread, spread, spread. You want spread, you want spread, you want spread. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. You want spread. Holy yeah. shit. It's fine. Pray mage, pray mage, boys. Pray mage, it's fine. Just pray mage. Oh, I died in the fuck's sake. It's fine, yeah. That, that was an obvious bait. It was a bait. <laughs> we had yeah, to be yeah. early, man. <laughs> nah, bro. Like, I knew I do, bro. It was obvious. It's fine. No, like it's not a good RSN, it's just super yeah, long, bro. You're coping. Yo, fell. I suggest you pipe the fuck down, lad. We all know how you get when you get flamed. You don't even have a mace. Picked. Yeah, I can't afford it. You should be able to after you looted the fucking toxic staff. Like, yeah, I'll be selling that for RO, mate. Are you gonna buy a fucking two he's McDonald's fucking, fucking fries? Yeah, he's, he's you mad? Nando's, bro. You get jealous, Nando's. kid. I'm not gonna lie, I'm training my Zerker's age right now. Rockets. Cool story, bro. No fell, I would flame you, but I'm gonna resist certain reasons. We all know. Yeah, yeah, mom. Be quick, be quick, be Logan quick. 374, come east. We're coming east. Alright, on three. One. Who's the target? Who's the target? Mason. Just get ready. On three, it's gonna be ooh, one. Two, two, three, two, two. Other one, other one, other one. Yo, go south, teleport, go south, teleport. Teleport, 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 teleport. Good job, good job. That's why we had to be really quick, boys. How better the world? Yo, by the way, when you spec like this, boys, Pinak teleport. It's the best. Uh, Tele Alcarid quick. Tele Everybody Tele Alcarid, Tele Alcarid. Go and bank your helmets. Go, go and bank everything except like mace, like defender, uh, myth cave, climbing boots, uh, rune gloves, and a mace on you. And have like a Tele on you too. Gonna be south of the cave entrance. Name? Link static, no Link static. 
Link starting. Click, 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 click. Go, 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 go. Mace, 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 and then spread south. He dead? Spread south, spread south, spread south, spread south, spread south, spread south. Yo, Play. We probably got that. Try to, try to get out, try to get out. You got it, you got it. Did anyone get the kill or not? The key, you got the key. I got the key, we didn't get it. Why? I don't know, it's 500k. Ah. Uh, Unlucky. Oh, fuck, man. Oh, you got overkill, like crazy. That yeah, was good shit, boys. That was well fucking done. Yeah. They killed like three, they kill like three fish, people. Bro. He, bro, he banked it. it. He must have banked no, it. No, he didn't bank it. Did I he, saw have it. he had it earlier. Yeah. Maybe someone like KO'd too quick. I don't know. I can check the footage after. It's fine. He's right northeast to you. Three towels northeast. Three towels northeast. Blue the mystic. Mace. mace instantly. Patient side. Patient yeah. side. Go, go, go. Go, 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 mace, go, go, mace, go. mace, mace, mace. Cook praise, mace, cook praise, Kill it, kill it. Kill him. Telly, telly, telly. Telly up. Get it, get it. I got it, we got it. Nice, Randy. Take screenshot and... Yo, who's Saki, by the way? And this guy said, be maced to him. Hey? He's in member chat. I don't know, he's in member chat asking for his fucking staff back. God, oh. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> That's so <laughs> he's, he's in my PMs right now. BC was the worst clanning experience I've ever had thus far. I was so bored during trips that I usually attended rot trips at the same time that I was echoing BC. I really wish that I was caught sooner and put out of my misery. I even tried to make it super obvious that I was spying by ghosting the clan during deadman mode to play with rot, by flaming myself on two accounts on public discords, even changing my profile pictures and description to be the exact same. On top of that, I dropped subtle hints to Benz many times and prayed that he caught on. None of this worked, which shows how easy it is to gaslight someone, especially a noob like Benz. If anyone is listening and wants to spy on their clan and have a chance to do what I did, make sure you PM A1V1 or rot underscore OTY on Discord. Don't let some Dutch dweebs dictate how you have fun in this game. Otherwise, you'll be stuck in a clan that has multiple layers of access because they're so paranoid of spies, to the point of not even trusting their own old school ranks. You'll have to listen to your leader's false promises of increased pulls and more action, only to get let down over and over again. Not only that, but those same leaders will talk shit about their own members and even flame their own ranks in private channels. Currently, BC is pretty much closed, with most of their members attending TK and Vitality events. They tried to join VR's alliance, but how long does that work when Benz hates VR and ironically calls them dog shit? If you had any kind of quality, bro, they would have cleared a the throat there, bro. I don't even joke. Bro, they are so bad, they just mass recruit everyone. Bro, they are so terrible. Like, I watched that fucking rot POV, bro. Like, they kept going in clumps like retards, bro. Speaking of Benz, he still clings on the hope that I'm on his side, thinking that I'll anti spy for him in the future. Yo, Benz. Yo, hey, what's up, man? How you doing, brother? I'm good, man. What's up? Why call me on this account? You know, you can't delete that shit anyway, right? It's all part of the plan. Why would I trust you, man? Like, it's almost, like, if you go back, it's almost been a year. It's okay if you don't trust me, bro. I mean, why, why be so whole secretly about it, bro? Like, you could just have told me on a, on a hider or something, you know? I, I don't even know if you're fucking with me right now or not, bro. So you don't trust me or what? You can't give me anything, like... Prove or anything that you you're not gonna fuck with me. It's part of the plan. All part of the big plan of Kim. All part of the big plan of Kim. If he hasn't learned his lesson yet, I don't think he ever will. Stay tuned for even more BC admin leaks on rs-rot.net or Twitter at rsrotnet1. We plan to not only leak full BC admin and senior logs but also post full, unedited BC trip POVs, where you can experience firsthand how terrible their trips are.